Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Brittany if you're new here and this is baby Carter. He is four months old now and I'm going to show you what our current nighttime routine looks like. I have not done this since having a baby and things have definitely changed. The biggest change is that our night routine actually starts now at around four in the afternoon. He goes to bed at seven o'clock so that's why it's still light out for most of the shots you're going to see. If you do enjoy this video and you like seeing baby Carter then please give this a thumbs up and let's go ahead and jump into it. So after Carter's afternoon nap, we'll have a little playtime. He will do tummy time, he'll play on his play gym, we'll bring out some of his toys, and most nights we also like to go on a walk around the neighborhood. At around 5.30, Ryan will come home and we've implemented a little tag team approach. So then Ryan will take Carter and they have their guy time for a little while so I can get some things done around the house. So I'll start by cooking dinner. This is from a meal kit. It's just pesto chicken with veggies and tortellini. It was super delicious. And I make an extra plate for Ryan to eat a little bit later. And then I do my quick nighttime cleaning routine. I will load and run the dishwasher. And then I go over and I clean up our living room, which has now become Carter's playroom. What I do every night is I collect all of his toys, I bring them back to my toy storage area, and I just quickly wipe each one down with these natural sanitizing wipes before putting them back, and then I grab a new set of toys and set them aside for the next day because I like to rotate out his toys daily so he doesn't get sick of them. I also like to quickly vacuum every day if I can since we have the dark hardwood that shows every single spec, and I'm so excited to be partnering with Dyson for this video because you guys know I'm obsessed with my Dyson cordless vacuum for over a year now, and I recently upgraded to the V8 and it's incredible. In particular, this is great for our family because our dog sheds her black fur all over the house and this just makes it really quick and easy to clean up. If you've never used a cordless vacuum, it really is a game changer. It gives you so much more freedom and it makes cleaning significantly faster and easier. And this V8 model has up to 40 minutes of runtime on a single charge, which is amazing. And honestly, I would say this is my favorite household product that I own. That's how much I love this thing. Once I vacuum up the hardwood, I'll switch over to the carpet attachment because this rug gets completely covered in dog fur. This vacuum can also transform into a handheld version, which I love to spot clean crumbs and fur off of our cream couch. I really cannot recommend this vacuum enough. It really is an investment in your home and I know you will absolutely love it. I'm going to have the link to purchase it down in the description box, so I definitely recommend that you check it out. So by this time it's around 6.30 and it's time to start Carter's bedtime routine. So we will change his diaper and put him into his PJs and then he will nurse and I will read him the same book every night. It's called I'll See You in the Morning. It's a really cute book. It's getting a little harder to read him now because he's really grabby and he tries to eat the book as I'm reading to him. Then I will move his docketot from his crib into the bed and I will rock him for a few minutes and sing to him. Ryan also goes to bed early because he wakes up early, so they kind of go to bed together. At this point, I get myself ready for bed, so I'll put on my PJs, robe, brush my teeth, wash my face, and then apply my skincare. I use all Vassor skincare products because that's my family skincare line. It's all natural, highly concentrated, professional strength products. They're amazing. So I start with Mandelic Acid Serum, which is my favorite gentle acne treatment product. You can even use this while pregnant, and it does not dry out the skin whatsoever. Then I use Super Serum. So this provides hydration with hyaluronic acid, and there's also an ingredient called DMAE, which tones and firms the skin, since now I'm trying to focus on anti aging and whatever product I have left over I always put on the back of my hands just a little tip then I finish off with some eye cream and I reapply my eye cream 
three or four times a day. I'm just obsessed with keeping my under eye area nice and plump and hydrated, especially because I don't sleep as much these days. I also apply this lash growing serum, which has worked amazingly well to grow up my lashes. And I finish off by applying some body oil all over my body. This has now become a nighttime ritual for me and just a small way to pamper myself. And I love the way it makes my skin feel. So at this point I have the house all to myself. I take my dog out, I feed her, we get to spend some time together, and then I'm able to get some work done. I will typically now sit at my computer from around 7.30 until 11, 12 at night getting all of my work done because since I'm with Carter all day, I'm not able to get much done during the day, so I have to now do everything at night. So once I'm all done, I tiptoe back into my room very quietly to not wake anyone up. I rub a little magnesium oil onto my feet and this is just a natural way to relax. I do this every night. And another thing I do every night since Carter's been born is I write one line a day into this really special notebook. So I get to capture one little memory every day and then I turn off the lights and that is pretty much it for my current nighttime routine with a baby. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my updated night routine. If you are new here, please subscribe. I do videos on organization, cleaning. I even do vlogs now. So if that's something you're interested in, I would love to have you as a subscriber. And with all that said, thanks so much for watching and I will see you soon with a new video. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay, baby Carter. So mom's not around right now, so let's have our guy time. I got some important stuff to show you. This is a dumbbell. Then we're gonna start flexing, or we can eat it a little bit, that's okay. So squeeze and release, and then squeeze. Baby hammer curls, squeeze, feel it burn, feel it burn. Get that mind-baby muscle Excuse connection. Me. What are you guys talking about right now? Are you teaching our four-month-old son how to work out? Yeah, I'm giving him tips and pointers. Four-month-old. You can never start too early. Just get a jump start on it.